All right, now to a live performance by perhaps a lesser known activity in the Chinese culture, Chinese yo-yo. Joining me again is Jeffrey Xu with the Milwaukee Chinese Community Center and the center's yo-yo performance team. So their ages, Jeffrey, range from 11 to 16, and I guess they're gonna show us a performance now. Let them go ahead and start that while you tell us how this works. Give us a sense of what's happening here. Yep. So what they're doing is they're playing with Chinese yo-yos. So the Chinese yo-yo is called the Kung Zhu, which basically translates to hollow bamboo and was first, first recorded to, uh, to be exist in, uh, from about 800 to 1,000 years ago. So these days, a Chinese yo-yo typically consists of two plastic sides and a bearing in the center instead of just a hollow piece of bamboo. And there are some variations, like the single-sided yo-yo that I have here, where there's only one side. And, the, and also, there's some ones that generate sound when they're spinning. So. Uh, so if someone wants to participate in the Youth Leadership Academy, how do they do that? Yeah, so our organization is a group of um, students and adults, about 46 students this year. And all you have to really do is just contact us. We have an email called biolamccc at gmail.com. So you can send me an email either now or next year's season, and then we'll get you in contact and set up. Well, Jeffrey, thank you so much for joining us today and sharing all of this for our viewers. It was wonderful having you on the show.